I, I, I can't ask. No change? Change anybody? No change? Anybody? No change? You're not going to help me out, sir? We're doing a show here. How about you? Anybody? Some change? Anybody? Nobody? Hey, can you get manager? You're this guy? This is part of the show. No change? Part of the show. No change. Nobody? Nobody? Swords of hatred, arrows and insensitivity, rocks of disdainful arrogance, the weapons of choice of the unaware and unperishable soldier of mankind, a corner of sanctuary, safeguarded with a cladded cloth, camouflage as a blanket of filth. I too am a soldier, but a circumstance. My brother, in a suit so fine. Could you please help me out and spare a dime? At the top of his lungs, he replied, get a job. And as he walked away, I stared, knowing that he was unaware that as early as last year, I was him. In an hour or two, he'll forget I even exist, but I'll remember him for eternity. Begging is not what I want to do. It's what I chose to do, considering my other choice was to steal. I too am a man. Today, as in every day, I converse with my one true friend, the one who never forsaken me like my family, both immediate and not so distant. No, not God, but me. Yes, I talk to myself and I talk out loud. And today we talked of how it used to be when we were married and had a family. But because of greed, he humbled me but left me with some sanity. Again, I will be free. My sister, you look good today. Could you throw some spare change my way? She said she would if I promised to pray. And I agreed. But amen was all I could remember. I hate to admit it, but I'm a pretender. Now give me some change and I'll be on my way. I said that to myself. And then in her pocketbook she went. I was hoping for at least 50 cents, but then she gave me $30. I damn near hollered. Take this, she said. Buy yourself some food and some bread and use the rest to turn your life around. And then she just walked away. With $30 that's now mine, I think it's time for a bottle of wine. The clock in the wall says it's after nine. The liquor store is open. <laughs> but something happened on the way to get that drink. I stopped in front of a hardware store and I started to think. Then I realized what was meant by that lady in pink, so I walked in. I left that store with $15 still in my pocket. A bucket in one hand and a squeegee in the other. Mine, bought and paid for, fresh off the shelf. Get a job? I don't need a job because as of today, I'm in business for myself. Yeah.